What's up guys, what's going on? Starsky up here another video. Today we are back in RimWorld, the awesomeness that is RimWorld. And what are we doing today? Well, we're getting hit by lightning, first and foremost. No, today we're going to continue our strip mining efforts, try to get some more uh, more of that stuff. And by the looks of it, our barracks is done. I'm going to want to fully... Actually, I can start on that right now. So, I will get to the battery work here. Just get going on that. I actually do not know what the most... I think doing it like this might actually be pretty efficient kind of unorthodox but i mean uh it works that's actually a pretty good thing i have going on it's actually not too shabby for a nice square room so cool uh, don't it's now patented this design uh do not steal it otherwise i'll sue you just kidding feel free to use it because that is what i am here for i am here to guide your efforts in rim world and i'm although i do admit to being a terrible guide I do want some props given where they are sometimes do. I don't know. I feel like I'm not too bad though. Luckily I do have you guys helping me out which is a huge plus because I, I'd probably still have like one building with all my shit outside if it wasn't for that. So thank you guys. Seriously. It is the always love you guys because you guys always help me out when I'm in need. And you guys are just awesome like that. So today I was probably going to bitch a little bit more about midterms. But... I have something new to bitch about. So as soon as I got home today, I actually took my first midterms today. It went surprisingly well. Uh, it's for my vocab one, I was like feeling like I was going to just absolutely fail. I don't know what happened. Like when my brain saw that paper, my brain just like, all right, body, it's time to go ham. Gray matter, we're doing this. And just what happened, what, what happens after, I don't even, I can't even comprehend. Like I'm just going automatic. I'm like a fucking machine gun running down these answers in that blank space. And I'm feeling like I, I'm feeling like I might have got an A on it if I'm lucky, and I'm just Jesus Christ, I went ham. Then also there's the other thing I had, which was the essay in class essay. Uh, how that went over? Ooh, I don't want to talk about that. Actually, that was pretty horrific. Uh, I had no time to finish it whatsoever, and it sucked. It sucked. Oh man, it sucked so much. Raiders have landed nearby. Well, that sucks even more. Luckily, oh shit, 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 Flynn. Flynn, what are you doing? Flynn, let's get the fuck out of there. I don't know what you're doing out there. I don't know what you were planning on doing, but we're fucking evacuating right now, all right? Because you're about to get shot at by a bunch of angry raiders. Luckily, they're kind of stupid, but where was I in my story? Okay, so uh, I had to write my English final today. We had about, uh, I'd have to roughly estimate, about a little bit less than 50 minutes to do it, and what happened was just terrible. It was ass. We just obliterated those bodies. That's the best way of doing it. It's a bit expensive, but that is the best way because there's only one way in and they get obliterated. Otherwise, Flynn, go back to doing your shit. So, back to my awesome story. Uh, actually, I can't focus on my story. I'm looking around making sure everything's going good. Okay, uh, let me just get a new mining project up and then I will continue my story because, as you probably know by now, I am insanely easily distracted. So, yeah, that'll just serve as the gateway there. So, we'll get five across. And we will continue our pattern of awesomeness. So, actually, fuck it. We'll, we'll get one down there, too. So, like I was saying, uh, we had our English final. We had, I mean, we got to prepare. Like, we knew the prompt for the essay. We knew uh, we had time to prepare. And we could bring in one, one, we could write on one side of an 8x11 or whatever the fuck the dimensions of a piece of notebook paper are. And we could write on that. And I did. It was a pretty decent outline. I like wrote out the whole introduction and conclusion and antithesis and bullshit like that. Uh, here's the thing. I, I didn't spend too much time on evidence. So in those 50 minutes, uh, I was I was it was a struggle. I'm not gonna lie, that shit. Ooh, baby. That took I mean I was I was using every single minute of that time and uh, I feel like it was a decent essay for my standards. Uh, but luckily, our teacher did say that he is going to grade it easier than otherwise because we had a time limit on the time to write it. He's not going to grade it like a multiple hour essay, which, fuck, last time I did an essay, I was chilling, like, I was lounging in Mexico. If you guys, for the other people, older people of the channel, you know I went to vacation like a couple months ago in Mexico. Last time I wrote my essay was like lounging in Mexico and it took me like four or five hours and I like wrote about why... Kanye West is and Miley Cyrus are bad role models. I don't know, but I got like a 96 on that essay, so I was doing something right. So in other terms, yeah, that essay, I was I was short as fuck on time. That was not a pleasant experience. It was not. I mean, it was it was all good and all. I mean, 
I understand why I gotta know how to write in the time limit because it'll probably be coming useful for other exams, but it still sucked a lot. I'm not gonna lie. So, uh, my story, now that I went off on that rant about my me going ham and me going not as ham as I'd like to, but still somewhat ham. Someone still has to build. Motherfucker, go build this shit. Seriously, it's not built. Motherfucker. Wait, yes it is. It is built. I don't... Apparently it is built. Okay. Let's disable that door. We don't really need that. Don't need that either. No. Actually, shit. Almost forgot here. We need some blasting charges. One, two, three, four. Get that shit set up. Oh, man. Those scrap... Scrap deposits are doing awesome. Oh, we just found some more. Yes. Score. Uh, so, like I was saying... Uh, I So I come home after a hard days of schooling with my midterms, and guess what I... Guess what I fucking find on the YouTube homepage? That is right. I mean, for I don't know, maybe some of you guys don't know, but YouTube is very trigger happy with changing their uh, their YouTube stuff. So what happened is there was another new layout. Now I thought we were in the clear, but I was obviously I was mistaken for ever thinking such a thing could happen. Like. YouTube being like not not really not YouTube not changing the layout that's blasphemy okay so YouTube changed the layout now I'm not mad about the layout itself yet because I haven't really had time to to really use it examine it and see how it is however I'm just mad that they keep changing it because it pisses me off all right so I mean I'm just I'm just angry really that's that's the only interpretation of this stuff I'm just angry that YouTube's changing more shit around it, I'm not now I don't want to like I don't want to say that it's bad because it might be good however every single fucking YouTube layout change has been ass so I'm not I'm going to go ahead and say it's probably not the best but I don't know, from a quick look I got at it, the channel layout's different and that kind of angers me because I, I liked my I liked my channel layout the way it was, uh, but YouTube's like, fuck you, Star Snipe, fuck you, the Apocalyptic Studio, fuck you, Flynn, you're going the wrong way. Uh, YouTube doesn't actually know about Flynn, they probably don't even know who the fuck I am, so, yeah. YouTube, if you're watching this, you should totally promote me and give me a million subscribers. I won't even be mad, I'd be totally satisfied with that. Uh, so... In other less shenanigans news, actually, I want to continue my thought, but I lost my train because of Flint's dumbass. Another dude, these local squirrels. What is going on? Is there like freaking a case of rabies going around? I don't know. I don't know. Also, is it just motherfucker? Flynn, get out of there. Or, yeah, Flynn's getting attacked by the squirrel. I swear to God, if this squirrel breaks down this motherfucking door before the raiders get to it, I'm gonna be mad. So I was uh, I was complaining about okay so yeah I don't know apparently every time I start to get used to the YouTube layout I'm like you know what it's not that bad YouTube just shoves a new one straight up our asses and I'm just like man what the fuck what the fuck okay this squirrel is doing me some favors here I like this this is this is solid good job they'll get rid of the squirrel for me so like I was saying yeah every time every time I'm just like you know what I'm kind of used to this YouTube layout it's not it's not too terrible to be honest but then. Do you know what happens? Then YouTube just like, Star Snipe, the apocalyptic studio. Fuck you. Fuck your opinions. You thought this layout was good all of a sudden. Bitch, please enjoy this new one. And I'm like, what the fuck, YouTube? This this sucks a dick. And they're just like, nah, nah, it's good. It's good. Get used to it. All right. Hopefully this guy gets within radius so he can get obliterated. Motherfucker. They got in. Ah, shit. You know what? I'll fucking, yeah, Flynn. Uh, well... We'll handle this the rough way. I don't want to spend too much shit here. Hopefully Barton does not friendly fire with the incendiary launcher because someone did tell me that they can friendly fire. And I was assuming that because I've seen people shoot each other before. So that's not exactly uh, good for teamwork, uh, teamwork's sake. But nonetheless, uh, I am under the assumption that all my people are idiots. So there is no worries with that. So, like I was saying, yeah, YouTube shoving this new stuff straight up our asses. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to be stereotypical and just hate on it because it's new. But I, I, I'm not big on giving YouTube the benefit of the doubt because all it is is just a bunch of Google Plus integration. And I'm not going to go into a full-on rant about this because I don't really have time, and this seems to be a somewhat short episode. But Google Plus, I mean, it has, it has its, it has its pluses. I'm totally cool with that. Uh, see what I did there? That was that was terrible. Oh my god! Can't believe I just did that. Okay, so Google Plus it has its pluses, and it's actually a pretty cool service once you get to use it. 
if you get used to it. Here's where the problem comes in. YouTube's just shoving it down your throat. They're not giving you the option anymore. If you make a new YouTube account, you're pretty much forced to make a Google Plus account, and I think that's totally wrong. Uh, it's, I mean, a comparison that I saw on Reddit, actually, funnily enough. Uh, it's kind of compared to Will Smith and Jaden Smith, and how Will Smith is constant. <laughs> friendly fire, dumbass. And how Will Smith is constantly trying to shove Jaden Smith down our throats and to enjoy him. And you know what? That's a perfect comparison. Google is constantly trying to shove a fucking shove Google Plus down our throats. And this is kind of where the comparison comes in. Like some people, they might like Jaden Smith, just like how they like Google Plus, except I'm not comparing the two because it's totally different things. It's just like apples to oranges. It's an analogy, not a comparison, because you can't really compare a fucking technological service to a person with questionable acting abilities. For the nice way of saying it. I don't know. I'm not. A, I'm. I'm not a fan of him. I, I am a fan of Will Smith, though. But I don't know. Not, not Jane Smith fan. Actually, I've watched like one movie. Actually, I've watched like I don't. I don't even know. I've seen him somewhere, and I just think I don't know. I don't know. But yeah. So with Google Plus, I mean, it is good. It has its positives. And the thing is, they're trying. Like I don't know what they're trying to do with it. They're trying to shove it down YouTube's like all all YouTubers' throats and just people who use YouTube in general. And that's kind of where the problem stems in, is that if you shove it down people's throats, they will not enjoy it. But, for it to be the devil's, uh, be the devil's advocate here, the problem and the, why they are doing this is because no one gave a fuck about Google Plus before, and although Google Plus has gained a lot of negative publicity because of this, it has nonetheless the use has increased and a couple people were like me were probably exposed to it and thought wow this is pretty cool i only use it like once a week to fucking share youtube videos but still it's not that bad you know and the notification system in the upper right hand corner i actually really like that like that's the one thing with google plus is that i get notified when people comment i can click on that notification and sends me straight to that shit i don't need to go to like my inbox or anything it's just conveniently in the upper right hand corner and i mean it it's it's good for sharing videos and having people in your circles and stuff but i mean i just don't like the methods they're using and with this new layout i don't know if they're just trying to further their own well they're obviously going to be furthering their own agenda that's what every corporation wants to do but i just don't know if it's if if this youtube updates is to improve youtube or shove more google plus down our throats and those two I mean, seemingly one is more important than the other for Google right now, and hopefully the more I get to see this update, the more more it proves otherwise, and more proves that maybe YouTube has put out a somewhat likable update for once, because they, they, I mean, as of late, they don't have a good track record with YouTube updates. They, they really don't, okay? Uh, they really don't, so I don't know. Yeah, fucking people knocking at my door. Oh man, family, clueless family, it's hilarious, you know, uh, I'll leave that for another rant. So, in summary, this update, I'm going to guess, and I'm probably going to be right, is that they're just trying to shove more Google Plus down our throat, and uh, I, I personally like Google Plus for being Google Plus, not as an addition to you, actually it is... Depending on your purpose of YouTube, like for content creators like me and the LP Channel Alliance, it, it has its benefits because it makes communicating with people a lot faster because you get notifications in the upper right hand corner and you don't need to constantly check. Uh, I usually check my email for notifications with new comments and stuff uh, or your inbox. Other method works fine. And I don't know. I just feel like it's it's just... Uh, I understand the reasons for it. I just don't like it, and I think I think most of you could agree with me that you guys don't like it either. So today, what did we get done? Well, shit, man, I I got off on that rant. Oh, yeah, sorry about that, guys. But I did get off on the rants. I did cover a for once. I think I was somewhat informative in my videos. That's that's surprisingly rare. Not gonna lie. But like I was saying. Uh, with with the YouTube stuff, I don't know where it's gonna go. I don't know if if like an actual competitor to YouTube will come up, and maybe YouTube will stop all these shenanigans and actually work on improving YouTube instead of integrating a different service into YouTube. I think that's the best way of putting it. That's what they're trying to do. 
their main priority right now is not to improve YouTube, but because with the recent updates, there haven't really been improvements to YouTube. Actually, there have been some deprovements. Is that the word for it? Like, uh, like I don't know. Like with the annot annotations, like it takes more clicks to disable annotations now, and it takes like uh, it's hard like. With the auto, like the auto setting on the freaking video buffer. Do not get me started on that. I will go off on like a 15 minute rant because that shit pisses me off because I'm like, I'm rendering a video in 480p or I'm, I'm loading a video in 480p. I'm like, all right, this is going well. This is going well. Google, what the fuck? 144p? I never even knew that was a setting before this auto bullshit. Like, come on, honestly. Just, just start in 360p and let me upscale it from there at my own choice. That's all I want because... I mean, I don't know. There's a mental break. No, there isn't. Okay, so I think that's enough rant for now. I'm, I've taken way too long that I wanted to take on this because I have some midterms tomorrow I have to take, but I just dropped a quarter that I was playing with in my hands. Uh, so pretty much the gist of it is YouTube, their main goal right now is... Or Google, their main goal right now, although improving YouTube is still one of their goals, the primary goal with YouTube is to integrate Google Plus into it and to get more adoption for it and while this may be beneficial in the future because it might improve google plus and make it a better service it is kind of just it's the the fusion was not done in the right fashion i guess because now they're trying to get people to use their first names as their accounts like i'm totally not cool with that i mean there's i have my reasons i don't want to disclose them though because like i said this video is taking way too long so i mean if you want to hear me rant more about stuff I, i'll be happy to just leave a comment saying yo star snipe be sure to rant about more stuff it's totally cool and also be sure to hit that like button because i'm leaving a comment so that doesn't make sense uh yeah but hit the like button it's cool so i uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video as always hit it be sure to like and this can be star snipe Signing out. Love you guys. See ya.